So, here's the situation. I have a naked window <laughs> letting the, the really hot sun come in. And I have some pieces of my leftover window film with the stained glass. Someone put some of it on this window, maybe some on that. And I have hinted, I've actually said, I have a big project going on in here. I am making a bed covering. Out of all the green fabrics, not all of them, just particular ones that I have pieced together. And at every stage of piecing it together, of sewing it together, of pinning it to the backing, or the, well, it's not a backing, it's fleece. It's gonna be inside. Why is it rolled up? I need to baste it. Stitches. Because I want to put a cotton backing on it. So I have this sheet that I have been using as a duvet cover. And um, Buddy tore a hole in it. And it's getting a little wore out for that kind of abuse. So what I am doing I'm going to, I need to dye it before I sew it because I don't want it to be white on, on all that green. I have been putting things off because there were so many parts to it and I, you're not, you probably won't see it finished for a while because I got to dye fabric. And before I dye the fabric, I have to pull this. Wow, that was really loud. Okay, so now it's quiet. <laughs> but it wasn't, it wasn't too horrible bad. I went back and listened, so you can still hear me. So I'm not going to tell you any, I'm not going to talk about any of that. What I'm going to talk to you about is why I actually came over here today. One, I have to... Uh, my seam ripper is over here, and I have to take this apart. Two, my boots. I haven't told you about my boots and what happened. Okay. My shoelace on my boot broke. So I pulled it out, and I thought, I'll just thread a new one through. Uh, no, it wouldn't go. It wouldn't go through. It was... <sighs> so, Betty came up with another idea, and this is what I did. I unstitched this, which is the casing where it fits, you see. So it's all unstitched. And what I'm going to do is use my sewing machine. I'm going to lay this down in here. I don't know what that is. Why it does that. The other one doesn't do it. Okay. So there's this nice groove in there where I can lay this. Fold this over, and then just stitch it on the machine. You reckon it'll work? <laughs> and you're saying, but will your machine do it? I think so. You ready? Let's give it a try. <laughs>
She might need safety glasses to sew, but I did it. I did it all the way, all the way to the end before the needle broke. So I think it'll hold. It doesn't really have a lot of stress on it. So whatever stitches and what well, looks good on that side. Oh, y'all, check out the stitching. Okay, then. Um, this was the first step. And the next step is, oh, they're too big. Oh, you know what? I need to fix that needle. But, um, and do a little more stitching. And then what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna wet my boots. I'm gonna put them on my feet. And what I'm hoping is as they dry, They'll shrink up to my feet and fit my fit my feet better. Um, and I want to do that, and then I'm going to fix this. <laughs> you know, it takes me a lot of time just keeping myself shod. <laughs> I crack myself up. I love y'all. Okay, I went back and fixed it, you see. And I just wanted you to know um, that I got approximately this far, right here, before the needle got bent. <laughs> and here's why. The presser foot, okay, and the needle's in between. So one side of the presser foot is on a ridge and the other isn't really hitting anything. So the needle is not really able to get down in there um, really well. But if you'll notice, sufficiently enough, it's holding it together. <laughs> Yay! Okay. Um, the next time you see me working on the big green blanket, I don't know. I don't know what I'll be wearing. I don't know when it'll be. I do know this. My hat, this hat that I have hand knit for myself um, over 20 years ago. <sighs> Surprisingly works well, even when it's hot outside. It's a very, it's like my head is shaded and I actually stay cooler with the wool, big wool hat on. And the other thing, I've got a protection. My eyes can be in the shade a little bit without my brim getting all in my face <laughs> like this in the wind. <laughs> oh my goodness. Okay, y'all, I'm a little excited because I've gotten things done today. So I am going to go put my moccasins on, and wet my feet. <laughs>